Fit like a bee, Danny Boy here, and welcome back to another episode of Transport Fever 2. We are down here at Seoul uh, because uh, this steel factory here is becoming, well, overrun, really. You can't support all the steel that's being taken from it. So, what we are going to do is I've set the boat that goes from here, steel, plastic, and shipping. I've now set that just to pick up plastic, a full load of plastic for all the ships and come back here because it's got a fair amount of steel and what we're going to do is I'm going to get this steel mill up and running. Now we've got a lot of coal here, there's coal over there etc etc uh, that we can use and there's a lot of iron ore here, one, two, well there's two iron ore there's one, two, three coal, so that should be enough to keep this ticking over. Then there's two that's really close, so we'll get them set up first, and then we'll get the train rolling back down here. And we'll also have another little train that bops iron ore down to here. Now, I'm not entirely sure where the station for this is going to go. Now, I want it to be quite large obviously we'll get the truck routes set up first though and what we'll do first is we'll upgrade the road so give me shiny new road up to there yep in fact we'll have it go all the way into town do that as well and that right now that should just be no issue for trucks to get down there. Now we'll make a little drop off for for them. Uh, now where do we want it to go? Now I'm thinking about placing it down here. It's just going to be a little route and we'll make it quite large. So we'll give it 30 meters. We're going to have yep two drop offs just right there. Is that still in range? It is. Right, let's configure this and give it a way out the back. One will come in through there, the other one will come in through that way. Once we set up a couple of waypoints, points, should be easy enough. Right, let's get some curved road. Pop you in there. Pop you into there. Easy. Right. Now, again, we're going to make this buildings quite large maybe just one uh, let's have it come in on the right hand side pop you on there and away it goes right configure let's make this large because from previous experience we've realized that these things can throw out a fair amount of raw resources and we don't want to be losing any right first route Line one, new line, it's going to go from there, it's going to go to there. Now that one has chosen to come in through that way. So let's actually, in between here, make a waypoint. Streets, waypoint, want it to go that way. Click on that, give me line one, manage the line, and after Minsk I want you to go there. And that's perfect. Right, pops in around the back side. That is fine. Now that's cool. So let's name it appropriately. So this will be Minsk Coal Transfer number one. Right, ready to rock and roll. Once the autosave is finished, then we'll get this route up and running. Then we'll deploy some trucks from somewhere. Don't really know where. Right, let's. There is a depot in Minsk. We'll just have to locate it. Again, we want you spun round. Get it in smartly. Whoops, pushed escape too many times there. Uh, cargo. Pop you out to the back there right that's sweet 
Now we just need a little road to connect it up. Streets, give me that. Pop you in there like so. Excellent. Right. This will be Minsk ore transfer. Number one. Now which way? You should drop off at that side. Yes. And we'll also get a waypoint there. So line one. Manage line. After there, add a station and go there. Right. Sweet. They won't interfere with each other too much now, which is much better. Right, so this is not line one. Minsk or transfer number one. Okay, away it goes. Now, I've got a freight station here. Which has got two lines, which is nice. Now I might take this coal down here and get a little train or it doesn't really seem worth it at the moment. I mean really. Buildings, streets, let's get you upgraded. Yep, you upgrade as far as there. And you can continue on. Now, I don't really want it to go through the city, per se. We could have it go around this back way. Now, it's gonna, that's quite a long journey. But it's okay. Where is other coal? Other coal is down here, and iron ore is down there. I thought there was three coal. One, two, Three. There it is. Yeah. Okay. We'll get this ore transferred up to there as well. Well, now we'll have to transfer fuel by train down to Minsk. That's why this station is here, Minsk West, which is fine. Uh, right. I'm actually going to get this set up because first, because it could be quite complicated. Now, in there. Have you go flush? Let's configure you cargo. Now, we should have spare steel from this, so if there's anywhere else that is lacking in steel production or requiring steel, we shall send it forth. Right, now, this line's going to be a lot more complicated. Now, it's going to come up here, round here. Now, I do have waypoints. There we go. Keep them round the outskirts of the city. So you're going there. I am disconcerned that the line hasn't gone that far up. If I just... Now I think I'll get another drop off at this side. Because we're going to need it. Uh, give me one of each, please. Whoa, 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 whoa. Push, press the bulldozer button there. Sometimes that's fatal. If you catch it just in time, you should be okay, right. I'll have that go there. Configure you. Very nice. And where are we going? Streets? Yep, streets. Give me curve. Pop you into there. Pop you into there. That's a bit weird, but it's okay. Right, you have line one, so line one, manage line, add a station. Now, is there another waypoint? I mean, it goes around here, that's fine. I would love to demolish this building, and I think I'm going to. We'll leave it one way. No, we'll leave it two way. Two way, go on this way. Couple of buildings were destroyed, but that should be it. Yeah, that road has gone down there as well. Alright, so other waypoints. I'd love the waypoints to be sort of highlighted as stations. Now, I think I've got one down here as well. Can't see them. Trees are in the way. I mean, it may just. Let's do this. Add a station. And see where it goes. Right, it is. 
continuing up that way, which is fine, but we wanted to come back. Ah, the waypoints do show up. There's little markers where you're there. Uh huh. That's weird. Okay, extinguish that one and click that one. There we go. And then it comes back around there with the other grain trucks. Sweet. Right, that line is done. But I haven't named it. Let's do that. So, Minsk Coal Transfer 1. No, 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 no. It's Transfer 2. Right, so that is ready. Playing Tupolev coming in for land in there, very nice. Let's get some vehicles rolling now. We'll get ten of each. Where's the depot? Now I do have a depot. There we go, Minsk Tram Depot. Not quite, not quite for what we, what we were looking for there. Now I'm super sucks that this food factory isn't. Sort of taking off. Ooh, available. Ooh, lots of stuff. The Volvo 5000, whatever the hell this is, that does 87 miles per hour. The Shinkansen E2 series. That's pretty sweet. We'll get them rolling at some point. Right, I'm gonna have to go old school and find the depot via this. Minsk Road Depot, you're way at the back there. Ah, it's a garage, that's why. Okay, manage vehicles, what do we want? I think we'll get some of these. No, 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 some of these. Buy 10 of, buy. Select you to go on high maintenance. And we'll get coal transfer to rolling first because it's further away right away they go and then we'll get 10 of these running cost is high Minsk or transfer one then we'll buy few more, 10 of, and set them for high, apply, and set them on Minsk coal transfer number one, right, away that goes. Now, let's get this other one hooked up, so we want it to go out this way which is fine. Now I love a little bridge. Pop it up just a touch. Now we've got several different bridges here. 56 miles per hour, let's go with that. Stone bridge. I think that'll be kind of cool. Yeah. Now the train is going to go along this way. Uh, we'll leave it with catenary, yes, because I've got a plan for this train. You're going to go over there. That's kind of cool. And then it's going to pop round and then go into here. Now I think, if there's room, we'll have it in the trees. So buildings, freight station. Let's make it 320, catenary, yes. One or two? Two, definitely two, right. That worked out quite well. I'm happy with that. That is actually connected to the station. Sweet. Now, we're probably running out of steel down here. This is looking good. Now, this has taken flight fairly quickly, even though there's no requirement for steel yet. Now, I am gonna pop that round like so 
pop that round to there and then we're going to upgrade this, that and that. Upgrade that as well because it will be used at some point. Alright, let's get this done. Buildings. Uh, just one platform on the right there. Getting a collision, but we won't get a collision for long. Pop you along there. Let's configure this and get cargo. Uh, there's a bear running across the cargo station. A little bear. Right, now this one was going to be new line, dink. And you're going to go in there. Now they're both coming in and out. So this one goes in. So what we should do is keep it the same. One and two. So line one, manage line, add a station on the way out. Hit that. And then go round. Sweet. And men's coal transfer manage. No, 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 no. Not manage vehicles. Manage line. Now you've got a few waypoints. But after this one, add a station. Hit that. And then it should be uh, perfect. Right, we're good to go. Now this is coal. This will be coal number three. Minsk, whoops, keep that in capitals, Minsk, coal, transfer number three, right, it is ready to rock and roll. Now, other train station is going to go along here. Now, rail, uh, we want that. I want it to sort of car stations would be nice around about this time. Let's have it go over here then. I just want one. Go there. Now in order to make this look slightly neater. Pop you in there. That's better. That's better. Now real now only one train is going to be operating down here so that's fine let's get the rail connection set up katanari yes one going around that way quite a steep turn but that's okay and then head you out through the trees there yes very nice right game doesn't like that does like that though stuff to check and make sure that connection actually actually made a connection I think it did though yep we're good right have this one go into there Right, not too bad, we've created a little valley there, that's okay. Perfect. Now this one will stop. This one will continue on and go round the back of Seoul. Now we might have a tunnel. I'm going to put the station in first. I'm going to take it round this way. Actually. Uh, buildings, terminal stop, one platform. I think there will be nice. That looks pretty bang on. Right in line with the airport. 
Might have slight issue getting track. There we go. That'll work. Now we need a road. Now this should be close enough to get this in. Stay on the flat, please. Just for just now. Okay, you don't want to stay on the flat. There you go. That is definitely absolutely connected. Yep. We've still got some steel waiting here, even though the ships are still rolling. 752, but this one's about to ship plastic. Or one of them is. 125 plastic of 189. Okay, that's good. That is good. Right, continuing on this track. Head out that way. Spin you around to there. That's okay, actually. I like the fact that it goes. Now, keeping a sort of decent speed, a 93. Down to 77 there, but the train more than likely won't go that fast. We'll do a bit of smoothing here and here. Uh, do a bit of smoothing here but leave this wall sort of high sided. Yep. Right, perfect. We've got these two set up. Now, first line. Skidoosh. Skidoosh. Line one. Yep. Not quite. Uh, this will be... We'll see. Soul or transfer. And line two is going to go from there out to there. Ah, doesn't like it. Could not connect to all stations. Right, so we've got a gap somewhere in the line. No gap. Wait. No, it's just a bear. It's the bear traveling across the tracks. Right, we're all good there. Right there. Okay, now it works. Okay, we need to get trains on here. And I think we'll demolish some more of these trees and just stick a depot. In there now we should be able to connect to both lines from this didn't check to make sure that the depot itself had catenary that could prove fatal and it does because you see the wires connected there right so two lines are ready to go this line two is actually going to be Minsk Steel transfer. Boom. Right, let's get that rolling first because our other stuff is going. Right, we've got a few things. What is this? It's a. It does 87 miles per hour. <laughs> okay, okay. 81 miles per hour for this thing. Ah, cool. We've got a. Uh, Higher capacity. This takes passengers? No, 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 no. <laughs> I somehow don't think so. The TRE E100 C Chiang Limited Express. Cool. We've also got this and this Russian class to use as well, although I think these. The EMU 500 by Taiwan Railways, that's cool. Starting to get more stuff. Loving the mods. Do you like the mods? Right, China Type 25C. This does 81. That does slightly less. 
in the Shinkansen E2 series. Coupling set back, not sure. Not entirely sure, but let's go electric. Thinking about using this crocodile again. Adding two of them and then doing cargo as these. Two hundred. Capacity of like three fifty. There we go. Bye. Set you on a line. Set your maintenance for high. This will be soul or transfer. Yes. One would imagine. All right. There we go. <coughs> so that train is away. Right. Buy vehicles. Electric again, we're going to go with this thing. Again, 62 miles per hour. Cargo, we want this. And give it a capacity of something like 252. Right, bye. Uh, don't want to replace it, just want to set its maintenance for high and set you on Minsk Steel Transfer. Or just Minsk steel transfer. Right, this guy's rolling out. It's gonna go collect some ore. I am aware of the fact that there's no trucks on here yet. We'll get some now from the truck depot, which is down here. Uh, we've got the Mars, that's pretty cool. Produced in Belarus, Volvo. That's Swedish. Sweden's kind of close to Russia. Pretty much, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Set your maintenance to high and set you on Minsk coal ore transfer number two, which I've just gone past. Number three, actually. Right. They are away rocking and rolling. Do you have steel? Yep. And we're getting steel here. And it's shooting up fairly quickly. We've got both our trains. Get you up to 40 miles per hour please. Uh, where are you going again? Ah, oh, you're going here. Nothing waiting yet. Ah, okay. It's, production has just started kicking in right now. It says there's six. Six been transported. Uh, that does not seem to be the case. Are you going on your appropriate line? You are. You're dead slow at the minute, but it's just because you've obviously got stuff happening. Uh, stuff's still rolling out of the depot back there. But this will work out fine. Right, so that is up and running. Sweet. That should supply steel. For this now we're down to 627 steel that's totally fine just want to check over here ah you are now boxed up waiting for these to get full loads now you've got 175 of 189 you will have to wait for a train to come in this is a ore and coal train this is still maintaining super duper high production we are locking ore iron ore over here right where's where's the train that brings plastic and I thought I made this train bigger how are you not managing to remove ah oh, you're there continue on my son continue on right plastic train should head up this way Or does it? I think plastic is being, yeah, Beijing plastic transfer. Now you're the one that goes all the way down. Yep, you are right. So let's manage vehicles. Now these things are pretty decent. So we're just going to duplicate them. And we're going to duplicate them again. 15. Don't know where the depot is. Not actually entirely sure where they would 
appear from. As long as this thing is still getting stuff, yes it is. I mean, we're starting to lose stuff here and we don't want that. They take 25, so 10 of them are about 250. That's nice, you're bringing 90 back. Do you have a lot? That's, an, that's something that I'm worried about. Ah, you're down here. You did leave about 40. You are waiting. You've got a lot of steel. That's good. You are waiting for a planks train to roll in. Here it is now. One of our glorious orange diesels. Nice. So that line we just created, the extra iron ore and steel, production etc etc did not give us sort of any more uh, goods to cities it just made one production line slightly less tax than another one slightly more efficient right there's a lot here 138 manage vehicle I'm gonna duplicate you twice we're gonna get Maintenance to high. Right, I want to see what this thing actually picks up because it looks like it leaves a lot. Now, half the train is not in a station. That's my bad. Now, it's got 266. Right, coal has been completely wiped out. We're now still picking up iron ore. I mean, it is still picking up coal. It's iron ore we need. Right, everything has been completely wiped out from the station there. Okay, here's the new trucks to pick up stuff from here. <coughs> Look at this thing, this beast. 204. It's doing its top speed like. Get have done with one or two more con mats there. This thing's heading out. Continue on, good sir. Ah, uh, you did pick up oh, 450 oil. Now, one of the things I wanted to do, we've got this oil factory here. There's a slight, slight issue in that it's not going hell for leather at the moment. Now, I want to get a thing here. The problem is, now, there may not be a problem, we'll have to check, but one of the things I wanted to do was get a, a port here and then have it bring oil around to there. Now there is other oil that we're going to take and get it down, so we're going to have to fly it in and then bring it and then we're gonna have to fly it out and send it to Budapest and send some over to Minsk via train trains gonna have to pop out this way and go round and then go along this way and into here et voila fuel for Minsk oh look at this thing how is this thing getting on but yep yeah, I think with the fact that I've got the station Maybe not stupidly placed, but not in the best place. That's going to cause an issue. How much did you... If I can actually click on... Oh, wow. Wow. That zoomed out a lot. Right, game has gone AWOL again. Hate it when it does that. So, let's go and look at this ship. Find the raw stock. Raw stock number two because Rostock number one is on a plastic line over beside Kiev it lost 1.4 million but it took 626 it looked like at some point how much is we in here can I make this dock larger that would be nice this run is already over overloaded uh, 
Now, configure. I don't know if this actually works. I'm going to take a wild stab in the dark and say no. It's still at 199. Now, if I make this... If I put a land in here, right? Or can I reconfigure this to be passenger miscellaneous misc? Click on that. In fact, go back. Go back, go back, go back, go back, go back. Click on terminals. Terminal 1, terminal 2, terminal. I mean, I went. I've seen it before. Part of this whole thing. Can you delete a terminal? No. No, no, no. It would seem not. And it doesn't use this over here either. Okay, so 200, uh, 205 is like its maximum. So if this ship goes faster, that would be nice. How are we getting on for food anyway? Now there's heaps stored, tons stored there. Uh, we are getting the food, Minsk food transfer is nice. Are we getting it here at the docks? We are 56. One's heading back, one is heading down. 43 of 63, that's not that great. Hopefully this thing sort of moves. I mean, it is going, it is producing stuff. I'll look at the airport here. Give me all the lines, or give me just this cargo line. Six. Six food. Who are you? Uh, you only got 14. It's all made money, though, weirdly. Ah, new stuff is available. Planes. Shanghai Airlines. Shandong Airlines. The Boeing 737-700, China Railways, that looks cool. Right, we're starting to get a lot of stuff. At the year 2000, we're gonna... We're gonna set the time to halt once more. There we go, you're getting more. It's not quite 55. But it's something, a truck has delivered somewhere. Over here, where, 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 who are you? Minsk food transfer, why are you going around in circles? That's stupid. Are you telling me that you can't change lane over to that side? Because if you are, that's kind of stupid. Manage vehicle, let's get one more of these. Set so maintenance for high, apply. Uh, yeah, you need to go around the block here. We should maybe make this a one. <laughs> it is, well, it is one way. It's not working entirely as we sort of wanted. Right, Airbus 28 of 37. And the thing is, Minsk, Beijing, yes. Ooh, Minsk, Kiev. And the other one behind you is Minsk, Kiev, right? Yep. So I think we can delete this one. You go away. Uh, 14. Uh, manage vehicles. Let's have a look at them. 1. 13. It's fine. I think 3. 3 seems to be okay. Uh, planes. Where are they? Oh, they are. Right. You. 14. 8. And 13. Ah, it's fine. 3 is fine. You're Sydney food shipping yet again, and there's nothing. Nothing waiting. I mean, there is stuff here. Truck is rolling in. 53. Other truck is rolling in. Yeah, so I think we'll be okay. I um, just want to check this. Right, we're finally getting ore. Not the 300 ore that this thing can transport. In fact, very little ore. There's 601 ore stored there. It's coal we're struggling with. Your coal, you're doing just fine. Alright, so... Let's actually set 
the Smarnage line at Upper Minsk. Wait for a full load, please. Here at Minsk Bus Tram Station 1. Is that you? For a full load. Excellent. So you shall now wait. Now you need to sort of ramp up production here, buddy. Everyone's sort of waiting on you. Now at Minsk Sidings, manage line. Wait for a full load. Alright, that's good. Good. Right, head down here. Now we'll have to get wood or planks into this tool factory to supply Minsk. Right, holy crap. This one has really kicked off. Configure? No. Manage vehicles. Select all. Let's duplicate them. Did it duplicate them? No. We may have crashed the game. No, it worked. I want to duplicate them again though. And this might crash the game. It could be because these are, I think these are mods. Can't remember. Ooh, they all seem to have worked. Right. <coughs> Fly, my pretties. Go down here and get stuff. <coughs> now, we've got some time. Minsk doesn't have any tools. It doesn't have any fuel. Seoul doesn't have any tools, but it has machines and it's doing quite well for machines fact there is a crap turn out because a ship has just delivered right now is this gonna work we're gonna try this out I'm gonna take a wild stab in the dark and say no however I do have a plan make it large one terminal Get as far back here as possible. Right, dink. Road. You there. Pop that curving round. Curve round to there. Okay. Come out of there. Go there. Now we're going to build this. Oh, it's so close. Right, I think we can get it. I think I can get it. I now know where. Oh, hello. Trees in the way. Give me that section of road. There we go, we got it. Right. If I do it about here, and take it around to there. Okay, a large dip in road. <laughs> right, it works. No one's going to use this death tunnel of deathness. Anyway, it's going to be fine. We just needed that to be in range. Right, that is sweet. Awesome. Right, continue on to here. Now, this is perfectly right next to where we need to go. Stick you around there. One dock, large, perfect. Pop you out that way. Sweet. Get you into there. Sweet. That's in range. Awesome. Right. I am really happy that that worked because this is nowhere near its full potential. I mean, it's filling up a train here, but we want this to start taking stuff over to Seoul. Ah, oh, that's very nice. I'm so happy that that worked. Uh, yes, if you could autosave, if you could uh, maybe scoot on a bit faster right to there. 
Ooh, it even takes this weird route through there. Which I shall allow. Now, this will be... S-E-O-U-L. So, oil transfer. And it's like refined oil, refined crude or something. And it needs to go to get refined into fuel. Now, it's not transfer. It's shipping. Sweet. Right, there's a tuple of coming in. It's going to pick up steel. No, it should have steel. Let's not get distracted though. Let's finish this line. I will pop you in there. Very nice. What do we have in the ship department? Cargo. The Merlin, the Viola does 19, you do 17, but you carry more. You do 17, but you carry less. 204, let's go with two Violas. Set them on. Soul oil shipping. Now that should be fine. Now really, we should have paused one, and I may do that. Come on, out you come. Go. Uh, just making sure, ah, right, the one from the back. That's weird. Ooh, it gets launched from a platform. Whoa! That one's going back in time. And, so I'd love, <laughs> I'd love the ships to actually come out. And I'd love like a huge dry dock for launching things like warships and stuff. Right, the viola. There's already six waiting. Wow. Now we could let that first six, first eight, nine, ten. We should let that roll out and then we'll set this one here to wait for a full load. That will separate them. Right, is it picked up anything? Don't know. It should have. Uh, yep. There you go. Ship 34. 12. Good man. Right, manage line at Hong Kong bus tram station 6, which is absolutely not a bus or tram station. Now, I don't want this bringing fuel back. So let's do manage the line again. Here, just load 100% and unload nothing. Now that should be it. Here, don't load anything and just unload refined oil. Right, this one will now wait for a full load. This one will head off. So not only is it stopped, but it's loading. So that's fine. Now it's going to be a fair distance. And we are going to obviously need other sources of crude coming in. Or other sources of oil, which we will get from over, over there, somewhere, there we go, Colocon, Colucan, oil refinery, uh-huh, I'm sure it is, right, what have you got, 351, and there's like another 240 away in there, okay, cool, so that is something like 626, don't actually care if that ship makes money. I just like it because it's cool. Oh, we are actually running out of grain here. That's starting to pick up. 68. Seventeen. Let's set use to wait for a full load. Manage line at Minsk Central. Wait for full load. Did we get that one in time? Yes, we did. Right, so why are the other grain 
stops here. Not filling up. I mean, you've got five. That's pretty poor. I mean, we definitely need more stuff. Now, we don't want to set the planes to wait for full loads. That's that's bad. That is bad. Let's actually go and look. We've got a crap ton of new planes there. Alright, here's all. So we've got the 757, we've got the 757 in different variants. We've got the A320 and China Eastern and Star Alliance liveries. We've got Air Busan as well. The Tupolev TU-204, Nippon Airways. Cool. Beijing Airlines, I've seen one of them before. The standard in-game Boeing 737-700. It's just 605 miles per hour. Sweet. Jeju Jet Air thing, Jeju Air. <laughs> Korean Air, sweet, we can use that. China Southern Airlines, cool. China United Airlines, cool. China Eastern, Boeing 737-700. Deerjet, that's Chinese as well. Shandong Airlines, Shanghai Airlines, two variants. Virgin, Virgin Australia. Uh, the Canada Air, no. <laughs> And the Boeing 7300C takes 20 in two compartments. This is like a newer version of that. It's the 200C, that's the 700C, okay. Alright, we'll have to mess about with some planes and get some stuff changed out. We're going to have a lot of 737s rocking around. Uh, Seoul Omsk Air Passenger. Christ, there's a lot of people there. Uh, 737 can't land there, unfortunately. What about Seoul to Shanghai? 16, Baku to Seoul, 8. I mean, I quite like these Shanghai 757s. Now, uh, look, the door's open. Hello. Oh. Uh, Oh well, goodbye. <laughs> right, but anywho, that's going to be it for that episode. Now, we'll have a look at some planes quickly in the first and the next episode. We'll see what liveried aircraft we can get rolling. But what I want to do is get... Is this one being used? Apparently it is. Apparently it is not. So what were you getting? Right, we've got one, two, three, four. Four of large amounts of wood. And we've got large amounts of wood over here for that. Right, that's good. So, we're going to have to get these three, four, into here. I'm then thinking ship the planks down to Budapest and then fly them over. In fact, I'm actually thinking about getting a small airfield in, say, here and using Hercules to drop them off. Let's actually... Where's my cargo airfield? Yes. Yep, it fits in fine. Terminals 2, hangar, ah, oh, that'll fit in there perfectly. Looks like we've got a 757 on a missed approach. No, it's going to Seoul. Okay, that's cool. Right, these are starting to go better now. Production is at 200, but it can level up. Which is weird. Let's quickly check our coal and stuff. You're sort of stuck. I think we are still producing quite a fair amount of steel, though. Oh, yeah, it's coal we're struggling with. 
Steel is being left here. This ore train. Now you've got zero. Why are you picking up oil? Manage line set. You can't carry coal. Which is odd, you're unopen? <laughs> right. That was weird. Manage vehicle, select all, replace with. Let's just check this. No, you don't take coal. Interesting. Very interesting. Well, that's weird. You do. There we go. Right, you start filling up. <laughs> so that's why we're short on coal. And that's why this sole coal mine over here. Right, we've, we've demolished most of the stuff. Ah, oh, no, it's not this one. It's this one over here where we're getting ridiculous amounts of coal. Yeah. So there are like 30 trucks somewhere. Heading down here. There we go. Grain, more grain. You're getting the idea. Now you do actually do. You do have to travel quite a fair distance. Right, Tupolev. Cargo Tupolev. Twenty of fifty-five. Gonna delete that one. Don't think I need that now. Fifty-five of fifty-five. 20 of 55, that's the one we're looking at. And 55 of 55. 3 seems fine for on there. Now, do I, if I set them away for a full load, they're all going to get stuck. This Tupolev is fine. Minsk, Kiev, here. Now, we're running standard. I mean, we could change them up. And what is the actual other line? Minsk, Beijing. Minsk, Kiev should really be t <laughs> Tupolevs. Because they're, well, kind of Russian. Look at this. Pew. Aircraft 7. Minsk, Beijing on its way. We'll have another look though. And then in the other episode, we'll get this set up. And we'll start getting tools to Minsk. 294, that's not too much. I think Seoul could possibly be done with some tools as well. Now, we've got quite a bit of congestion on our missions in Seoul, but that's okay. Not that worried about that. I would like it to grow. We'll have a quick look at size. I mean, Baghdad was one of the first cities that we got rolling, but it's still struggling. 379. Melbourne hasn't been touched. All the rest of these are starting to come up. Seoul, again. All these ones, bar Minsk, which has nothing, and Budapest, which has nothing. Kyoto has no goods coming in. So, yeah, I want to get tools into Seoul. I want to get tools into Minsk as well. <coughs> that Melbourne, last but not least, poor little Melbourne. Now, Baghdad probably could just use some more routes. I mean, its growth is at 400%, so it's climbed quite rapidly. Top of the leaderboard, Tokyo. Warsaw in second. Warsaw needs more machines. Hmm. Tools are good. Ho Chi Minh, Shanghai, back up. Minsk is climbing rapidly as well. I mean, these are so some of these are near 500 percent I think 500 percent oh, 550 percent for st. Petersburg okay cool Minsk needs another transport route 
public transport, yep. Private transport? Yeah, not many people in Minsk will have a car. There's nowhere to drive to. They can now drive to Seoul via this road, and it looks like they are. What is that? It's like a Volvo... No, it's like a Volkswagen GTI of old. Most definitely. And this guy is running a Mini? No. Something weird. Don't recognize that symbol on the back. Okay, continue on. Boris Gulabev. <laughs> right, but we'll leave it there for that episode. We've got this industry up and running. Uh, we're getting ore here? No. We're getting coal here now? Maybe. Are you still the first truck? 2 of 19. <laughs> right, go. Start. Production is at 400, apparently. We're in December 2nd of 1998. France 98 is on the go, or France 98 would actually be finished by now. This thing has taken no more than 26 in here. We are getting decent amounts of steel, 63. We are getting now decent amounts of coal. The Degu Steel Mill. Degu Steel Mill. Hmm. I mean, that may be all she wrote for this. I mean, it's only supplying one factory. We could send steel down to the airport. Although, I'd like another passenger route in Minsk. We've got two, we've got four left. I mean, we could maybe get that other airfield in and ship steel out. I don't know to somewhere where it actually needs it. Who knows? But that's going to be it for this episode. Let's jump on board one of our super duper new trains. Uh, there we go. Oh, look at this. These two are rolling in together. But yep, yeah, that's going to be it for this episode. As always, if you did watch this and you would like to leave a like, comment or dislike, Please feel free to do so, and if there is more you would like to see in the future, then hit the subscribe button. I've been Danny Boy, this has been Transport Fever 2, and I will catch you later.